Hi, my name is Emily and I work here at PGACO as an online QuickBooks specialist. I am an advanced pro advisor and I hope that this video answers any of your questions or queries you may have. If it doesn't, however, there will be a link at the end of the video taking you to my Find an Accountant page. Here you'll find reviews from some of my current clients and you can get in touch with any questions or queries you may have. Also, don't forget to like and subscribe to this YouTube channel for any future updates and new videos. Thank you very much. In this video I am going to show you how to allocate salary payments within QuickBooks Online. To start with navigate to the banking section and find the transaction which relates to salary. The first example I'm going to look at is the director's salary here on the 25th of November. For any director's salary, you will need to click on the transaction and change the transaction type from an expense to a transfer. This is going to be a transfer to the director's current account. Once you're happy that information is correct, you can simply click add. For employee salary payment, the same date here, we will click on it again and change from an expense to a transfer. This time, we're going to transfer to an account called Wages and Salary Control. Click Add and that will be accounted for. You may want to consider setting up bank rules for these transactions and you can learn how to do this by visiting our bank rules video on our YouTube channel.